Alright, so you guys might be wondering, why am I playing Toho 6 again? <laughs> and I know, yes, that is a very good question, I know. So the reason for this is, uh, it's pretty similar to what I did with my uh, Toho 8 playthrough. So you might remember that I, uh, I did Toho 8, I got kind of sick of fighting Moko over and over, so I ended up using something called the Toho Practice. Um, I don't know, I think it's just called TH Prac. Yeah. So, basically I have this program that lets you practice any spell card you want, any uh, attack, any part of a stage, over and over again. So you don't have to play through the entire stage or just do a certain spell card, you know? So, I have not played Toho 6 since, um... Since it came out, pretty much. Well, you know what I mean. Uh, the last time I played it properly was when I did the Let's Play a year ago. Actually, it was a little over a year ago. It was like 14 months ago, almost. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe not that much, but I do remember playing last playing in like May or June properly. So what we're gonna do today is we're gonna do the Flan. We're gonna we're gonna fight Flandre. Because I don't have the patience to beat Flandre legitimately. And I'm just going to do the same thing I did with Moko. Except I might be a little bit more fair than I was to Moko. And the great thing is that um, it works with either of the characters. You can actually... I can fight Flandre with Rainbow if I wanted to. So yeah. So what I'll do is I'll go to Flandre stage and I'll have... You know, three lives and three bombs, like usual. Uh, is there a way I can start with... Can I, like, use the mouse for this? We can, we're gonna start with no power. And, you know, we'll treat it like we're doing, you know, the fight normally. Or, you know what I mean, right? So, we're just gonna do the level normally. And then if I ever get a game over or anything... Then, um, yeah, also, I don't remember what my button is to slow down. Well, it's definitely not that. Okay, it's the, it's R1. I actually have not played this level in so long, I forgot what it's like. See, cause I see it's weird coming back to this game after playing Toho 8 so much. Cause I'm so used to all of the funny mechanics of that game. Yeah, fuck it, we'll just use our bombs, why not? But yeah, I remember this all being a pain in the ass, regardless. The ideal to who gamer mindset. Anyways, here's Patchy. We love Patchy up in this place. <laughs> From what I remember, Patchy was a uh, really a really annoying mid boss as well. <laughs> Yeah, as you can see. <laughs> Solar Flare! I think to this day I still have not learned how to do her attacks. <laughs> Which makes it even funnier. I remember I ended up just bombing them. Even though her bombs are kind of... Marissa's bombs are kind of ass, honestly. Oh, fuck. I forgot about this part of the level, too. Shit. Oh, yeah, that's right, because Toho 6 works differently from all the other Toho games. 
because they don't it's not based off of an actual like point collection system it's actually based on um it's based on how what your score is which is where it is very different from how I'm used to now <laughs> Man, chill out, will ya? Well, that went well. <laughs> I like how it still says Moonness after all this time. Fucking Moonness. So what I'll probably do is I'll be a little bit more fair with my checkpoints. Well... I say fair in, like, the game's eyes. So what I'll do is I think I'll start from the mid-boss. I mean, plus I like pa practicing patchy spells anyway. No wonder Patchy's so beloved. Because she's the extra stage boss in this game. It makes so much more sense now. Gotta love Patchy. I mean, to be honest, I would have used... I, I still don't know which is better, Marissa A or Marissa B. I'm pretty sure a lot of people tend to speedrun this game with Marissa A. Do what I did. That's how I beat this game. You get a fuck ton of lives. Oh god, I keep forgetting about these stupid fucking fairies. They just spam bullets at you, man. It, it's, again, it is still really, really weird to come back to this game after playing Toho 8. <laughs> I bet it'd feel even weirder to go back to the, like, Lotus Land story or something. Alright, here's more bullets. Bu bullet spam. Bullet spam. It's raining in bullets. Oh, you just get a, you just get an extra life there. Okay, I kind of forgot about that. I'm so used to I'm so used to the other ones where you have to fight like this kind of mini boss ass fairy to get a life, and if you bomb it, you don't get an extra life. It's really weird. <laughs> Ramilia is at the shrine. Here's the flan. And her funny theme song. About to die already. <laughs> oh yeah, this is usually where I die. It's going exceptionally well, I gotta say. My dumbass forgot how to dodge her attacks. I think that's how you dodge it.
Oh, okay, well that didn't go well at all. <laughs> yeah, the thing I find- oh, look at all these names. We have Monomo, Noog, Meanness, Mooheg, Mover, Moom, Mustafa, Moopy, Moonty, Mulo, Minus, and Moonis. I gotta get better with my fucking names, dude. Um... How about- how about me who? We're adding to our- we're adding to my funny list of names for Toho 6. You know, I'm gonna- another thing. If- once I beat Flandre, I'm also gonna go back to- I'm also gonna go back to Toho 7. I'm gonna see if I can beat Ron as well. Well, I guess we'll warp to the, uh... The boss. The end boss, yeah. The thing I like about Flandre's theme is that it sounds like literally nothing like the rest of the game. That might just be me, but it doesn't sound like any other song in this game. Because a lot of the songs in this game, a lot of the, a lot of the songs kind of have a similar sound to them, but this song just doesn't sound anything else like Toho Six. It's weird. It's so different that it's kind of become its own identity. <laughs> yes, Flandre moment. Alright. Give me the power. So I have actually seen all of Flandre's fight. But I'm just like absolute shit. At fighting her. And that, that, also, that can also happen. Ah, I keep thinking I'm a Toho 8 Marissa where I can just go to the POC and get my stuff. Four of a kind. Wow. <laughs> well, that was just stupid. See, I'm getting- I'm- I'm fucking up so much because I keep thinking I'm Toho 8 Marissa. <laughs> God damn it. Also, I think the percentage is getting all confused now. So what I'll probably do is every time I die, I'll increase the spell by one. I love that. It'll give Flandre a fair fighting chance, and this won't be a 20-minute stream, either. I mean, Flandre is one of the hardest bosses in gaming for a reason. <laughs> like, she just never stops attacking you. Mm-hmm. 
Well, one little bit of power. Kagome, Kagome. It's kind of funny how they referenced Kagome Kagome twice in the Toho series. Because <laughs> they, they made Bunny do it in uh, Toho 8 as well. Maze of Love. I gotta be grandma too, true. Cause that's the thing, that's the funny thing about, um, oops. That's the funny thing about Toho 7, is you can't just beat Ron, you also gotta beat Yukari later on too. Which honestly, I don't know how the fuck I could have done that. Alright, well, let's try, um, let's start at boss non-spell too. I ironically find this one of her easier spell cards now. I used to think that shit was so hard, and now I'm like, that, that one's easy, what are you talking about? <laughs> one thing I really love. Also, I forgot that when you pause in this game, the music doesn't stop. That's so weird. I forgot that, um... When it, the funny thing is, whenever Flandre does her spell cards, there's just a giant Flandre in the background. Which I always find really hilarious. Because Moko does that too, and I think Ron might? I don't know. Give me those peas. Even though I don't think I need them. Yeah, I mean, honestly, Flandre's, uh, non cells are, like, hella chill. Alright, back to Maze of Love. Actually, we never did Maze of Love yet. Kind of reminds me of Boonie a bit. I can see why people love her theme song so much. <laughs> it's also probably because people spent so goddamn long on her boss fight. <laughs> Longer than I have the patience for. I mean, you only live once, so... Oops. 
Oh yeah, there's this fucking batshit insane spell card. <laughs> God damn it. People like it because of Ron McDonald. You know what? That's also a good point. Ron McDonald is also to blame. <laughs> I've gotten better at fighting her, for sure. He's almost dead, I don't know why I used that. You can just kind of stand still during that kill. Oops. He was about to die too, that's the sad part. Back to Maze of Love, which reminds me of Subspace Emissary. Oops. So this is Taboo, and it says Maze, and I'm like, oh yeah, great maze. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> that was a good death bomb there. I'll use my bombs if I have them. Yeah, this spell card is fucking insane. <laughs> <laughs> the Flan owns McDonald's. <laughs> and yes, Taboo is... Taboo's easy. Taboo's easy compared to the Flan. Give me some extra points, I guess. I guess that is, I guess there is that one thing with, ta with Taboo. 
Toho 6. Considering Toho 6 has a lot more RNG in it than most Toho games, which makes it really annoying to play. Sometimes Flan will just kill you for no reason because her bullshit patterns are randomized. I might be, that might just be me making excuses, but that is something I once heard, is that Toho 6 is generally more RNG-based than other Tohos. So, yeah. Dang. Not doing very good here, huh? Oh. Have some stars. Okay, I just did not dodge, apparently. <laughs> Great. Top 10 hardest bosses. Alright, let's warp to four of a kind. Hey, man, it gives me more chance to, j to jam out to her theme song. <laughs> Whoops. I slept, Daddy. Alright, Maze of Love. We'll see how bad I am with this today. Pretty bad. <laughs> I usually just end up burning through, um... I just end up burning through a life there, pretty much. This, pro this has to be one of her easier spells, though, because it's literally just bullets going downwards. <laughs> There's nothing challenging about that. Yeah, rain bullets. Er, fuck. <laughs> this game does tend to be unfair because of its RNG, like I said. Okay, um... Non-spell 4. Easy. Not easy. <laughs> Bro, I died to a non spell. What the fuck? I died to another non spell. <laughs> eh. 
Hey, if I use your bomb. Well, this attempt isn't going very well. You know what, actually, I think, I'm pretty sure Malko has a pretty similar spell to this one. Makes a lot of sense now, doesn't it? Fuck. Okay, well that didn't go well. Just one of those naturally really shitty attempts, you know? And so is this one. This one's also shitty. I'm using my, uh, my bombs more. Yeah, Marissa A's bomb really does suck. Yeah, I, I hate this spell. Only get some free shots off. the bomb as well. Alright, we're back here again. Bro, come on, what are you doing? What are you looking at? You're looking at bullshit. <laughs> That's what you're looking at. I know the final spells are pretty bullshit, too. Every time, dude, I die to that one. <laughs> hey. After I die of the final spell, I literally scream. <laughs> Damn. Wow, come on, man. 
This one just seems to eat through all my my lives. Oh, this is new. This is brand new. Okay. <laughs> wow, that went really well. I literally don't know how to get through Maze of Love without dying. I'm so bad at it, dude. You know, imagine not having the practice spells, practice codes, and then getting to that one over and over and then dying. This be painful. Spam the bombs. I'm kind of getting better at it, sort of. Four. Wow, it just burns through my lives. Yeah, see, this is why I'm never doing a, a proper Toho uh, extra stage. I'd be happy to watch it. I'd also be happy to die, apparently. We're back here again. It's like I've learned nothing. Bruh. I've literally learned nothing about this spell. The only thing I've learned is I suck ass at it. <laughs> hey, Connor, what's up? Four. Uh, that would be so funny if I got that to work. I was- I almost- I was gonna run up the timer, dude. I haven't gotten to her, like, endurance spell yet.
Oh, come on, there was like the little bullet there. Mate. He has like no health left. What's going on here? There we go. Okay, that was just stupid. <laughs> You'll regret watching someone else's playthrough. Is that so? Sono no ka. <laughs> Some, have some stars. I mean, the star. Since the stars don't work on her spell, on her spells, just use them now. Do what you do in a uh, Kalgius fight, you know? Alright, get back into position here. There we go. Clock that takes away the past. Oh yeah, this fucking attack. I am really bad at this one. This one can kiss ass. Oh! Fuck. <laughs> it just makes you want to finish the boss fight? Yeah. It, it's a pretty long boss. It's like, isn't it like eight minutes long or something? That already flawed. There we go. And then there will be none. Yeah, this fucking spell. I mean, it's based on you and Owen was her. And then there will be none. Which is like a book or something, I don't remember. I just know that's a thing, and that's what her song's named after. Bro. Yeah, this attack is fucking weird. I never got the chance to see this legitimately. Yeah, you gotta make sure you don't fuck this part up. Because this part, pretty easy to cock up.
where. Just bought it. Right, anyways, here's her last spell card. Ripples of 495 years. <laughs> I got a follower. And I died. Mm -hmm. Well, there you go. That was a, a good attempt. <laughs> That's probably how Jose died, honestly. I don't mind waiting out the timer, honestly. to slip in through there. Yeah, honestly, this attack is pretty piss easy, I gotta say. Like this, I can I can do no problem, honestly. And then I die. Okay, never mind. Forget it. Forget what I said. Being like close to the bottom is good. I'm just gonna bomb this. Ripples of 495 years. Just your average spell card. It starts to get faster. <laughs> yeah. Did it. Did it. I beat I beat Flandre. Whew. Oh, that took a bit. Holy shit. Laundry is so sad. <laughs> I'm gonna go home now. <laughs> I've had enough. Flan, the Flan will be alone. Music note? Does that mean you're gonna hang yourself? <laughs> you know what? I might have to take a screenshot of that.
<laughs> you went invisible during that attack. She died by the bullet and then there were none. Like, I, th I think they're just like quoting the fucking rhyme or whatever. Unfortunately, I'm pretty good dodging. <laughs> I'll introduce you to a girl from the shrine. Lawn Mary's Reimu confirmed. <laughs> wow, I, my, my progression rate was 18%. <laughs> Wow. That was easy. You know what, I'm kind of curious what Reimu has to say about that fight. Are you crazy? Not what I meant to do. I never fought- I never played as Reimu in this game, actually. Reimu A. Yeah, you know what? Let's just see what Reimu has to say about this fight. Well, I've never used that spell before. It's kind of wild. The fight isn't over until I win with Reimu. You know, I'm kinda glad I didn't play with Reimu A now, because this is taking forever. This is the power of those who serve gods. I don't believe that you won. There's still more. Eh? Hey, you seem really bad and you seem in pretty bad shape. Find that one flan remix from Mario Kart Wii. Yes, I can't even s s smake smoke anymore? Wait, Flandre smokes? Oh, wait, no, she says shoot smoke. I'll come play whenever you wish. So please don't come to the shrine. I was thinking of visiting you with cake and tea and thanks. Try not to bring your kind of food to a human's place. It's not too sweet, is it? Even if sugar-free, good girls go home quietly and go to sleep. But I am home? So you don't need to go home, fitting for a bad girl. I'm going home now. I left another bad girl at the shrine after all. <laughs> what do you mean, bad girl? You and your sister. Well, that's, like, that's, a ba that's an awesome line to end off the game on. All right, we'll call this one, uh, Loon. There we go. <laughs> yep, next time I'm gonna fight Ron, which will go great, trust me. This one's called Floon. Well, there you go, guys. That was Toho 6. For real this time, I freaking beat it. Not legitimately, but hey, I did it. There's two extra bosses in Toho 7, so that's gonna be extra fun. I get to fight, um... I get to fight Foxy Mama, and then Gap Grandma. That'll be extra good. Oh yeah, get us into the music, by the way. I don't know what that weird bar is. Sure, we'll listen to this song. I just wanted to fight Flandre for one simple reason. Because Toho 6 and 7 don't have proper finales. And I really wanted to end off these series properly. Just so I can say, like, I've actually beaten them. And I can get rid of them finally. And just have them done. Because... Yeah. 
Fox Mommy and Real Mommy. <laughs> you know what? That's a that's an even that's an even better name for them, I think. Yeah, because I never got to see all of Ron's spells myself, so I think it'll be nice to finally see those as well. Cause I got to like I don't know maybe like two spells in, and then I just said fuck it, I'm I'm giving up. But yeah, anyways, guys, thank you for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe to me on YouTube and Twitch. And, um... <laughs> will you finally make a debate who's worse to fight against? Um... I, I guess. I guess I can make a debate on that. But, anyways, I will see you guys, um, probably next week. Next week, I will do Toho 7 as well. We'll fight, um... We'll fight Flan, not Flan. We'll fight Ron and Yukari, which I have never done before. So that'll be really cool. And then we'll finally have finales for both Toho Six and Toho Seven. And then uh, when, like, I don't know, winter rolls around, I can probably do um, when winter rolls around, I can finally do Toho Nine. So we can do that because we've been doing a lot of Toho on the channel recently, like. Toho 10.5, 12.3, Yeah. But, yep. Short finale, I guess, but not really much I can do to make this longer, so I'll see you guys then. Take care.